From orbiting the Earth and hanging out with astronauts, to chilling at Randy's Donut Shop downtown LA, Space Shuttle Endeavour has done it all. On June 1, 2011, after flying over 120 million miles over the course of 25 missions completed since 1992, Endeavour came home for good. But it had one last trip scheduled, and it took a lot of Endeavour to make this trip possible for Endeavour. A trip to LA. It all started with a first-class ticket from Kennedy Space Center in Florida to Los Angeles International Airport in California. Apparently, Endeavour took it literally when they said, hop on the plane. Endeavour got an aerial tour of LA while passing over landmarks including the Hollywood sign. The pilot in that chase aircraft probably took a bunch of really nice selfies too. But you can't say you've experienced LA without experiencing the traffic. After three weeks of preparation, the shuttle took off on foot on a 12-mile commute that took two days through the streets of LA as it moved from LAX to its permanent museum home at the California Science Center. And for once, the LA traffic was justified. But going from a top speed of 17,000 miles per hour in space to moving at 2 miles per hour on the street must have been a bummer. For most of the drive, Endeavour sat on a special transporter that's used for moving bridge pieces. Having a 78-foot wingspan and a 58-foot tall tail also didn't help as hundreds of street signs, traffic signals and trees had to be cleared. It cost $10 million to drive the shuttle through the city and at no cost to the taxpayers. It was all covered through donations. But why did the shuttle cross the highway? You probably already figured it out. It's not rocket science.